Hey guys, Triple C coming at you tonight. Uh, I got a package in the mail. I ordered this off of eBay. Uh, this here is aluminum. And This here's a sight pusher, a universal sight pusher. I got it off eBay for like 35 bucks or something like that. Uh, I got those sights, those uh, Mipro light sights, not too long ago. That's wrong. Thought about it and thought about it. Also, uh, I got this here uh, Squirrel Daddy Glock front sight tool uh 316 stainless steel uh i gotta give a big shout out to jack ammo he's the one that uh kind of got me on to the squirrel daddy tools for guns they they kick ass man uh so thanks to jack for that appreciate it jack they make some nice stuff <clears throat> for building ars and stuff like that but anyhow uh i bought the sights and all that so uh, I thought about it and thought about it I thought about taking it to the gunsmith and he charged me like uh, 40 bucks so I think this is like five dollars and some change for this Glock tool which is the awesome price for a stainless steel tool like that it's real very, very nice so anyhow got online eBay and I did a little bit of reviews on YouTube you know you can find anything on YouTube so I looked this up I seen them on eBay I looked them up and they everybody had pretty decent reviews on them so I went ahead and bought one and uh, I'll tell you what it's quality piece for 35 bucks uh, it doesn't that's hard hardened steel it's got let me pull this here velcro strip out it's got an angled piece for angled sights and a straight side as well. <clears throat> and you just put this in there just to keep your uh, slide from getting tore up. But not, nah, it works perfect. So uh, let me show you the results. There they are. Perfect man, not a scratch on them. A little oily. I oiled them up, but so if you got a, if you don't have one, then I think it's a very good investment. Front sight. It's all locked tighted in there. <clears throat> so yeah, it, it turned out pretty good. I'm pretty happy. So not only did I, you know, now that I can, I can do my own damn sights. Or push sides to adjust them if I need to uh, pretty much I'm happy with it I'm happy with the sides they're very bright for $55 or whatever they were uh, you can't beat them man it's a hell of a deal for and they you push them out from right to left push the old one out from right to left and then push the new one in from left to right and it went in no problem I mean, it's tight. Don't get me wrong. It's tight, but I used a gear wrench. You know, you're supposed to tighten the bolt head, not the nut. But, yeah, it went on flawlessly. This thing works really nice. You just spin that nut, and then you move it all the way across there like, like so. It's a quality piece, man. And you can use it on, like, a 1911s and stuff as well. Got different blocks. Uh, I think you can use that those angled ones right there on uh, XD XDMs Springfield. So that's it, guys. Really, uh, I know a couple of you guys got 19s and <clears throat> got some Glock pistols. Uh, that's the way to go, brother. I'm telling you, this is the very nice. Turned out really nice. I'm happy with them. 
can't believe. I mean, for thirty-five, I was paying thirty, forty dollars just to have uh, sites installed, and I'd have to drive an hour to get it done, one way, an hour to uh, Gander Mountains, who was doing my last pistol, that my SR twenty-two, my Ruger. <clears throat> but no, nah, man, it didn't turn out bad at all. Did not mar the frame or nothing, so. Almost like they were done at factory. I'm, I'm impressed. So I'll stop rambling. It's been almost six minutes already. So there you go, guys. That's my little video. Uh, you might pick one of them up. Pretty handy. So thanks for watching. Keep on subscribing. Old Channel Cats out.